wiring instructions for maglock kit. First, you need to cut off the end of the transformer. On the transformer, you will then identify the positive and negative wires. Just to note that the positive side will have dashes or a solid white line running along that side of the wire. Second, on the receiver cable harness, you're going to need to identify four control wires. The red wire, which will be your positive, the black wire, which will be your negative, the yellow wire, which will be your common, and the blue wire, which is your normally closed contact. Then connect the positive from your receiver to the positive from the transformer. Connect the negative from the receiver to the negative from the transformer. Also connect the common from the receiver to the negative wires from the transformer. You should now have the normally closed wire from the receiver free. Now connect the harness to the receiver. Now you must program the receiver and transmitters by matching the sequence on the dip switches of both. On the cable coming from the motion sensor harness, you will need to identify the positive, which is your red wire, the negative, which is your black wire, the common, which is your yellow wire, and the normally closed, which is your blue wire. Now connect the positive from the motion sensor to the positive from the transformer. Connect the negative from the motion sensor to the negative from the transformer. Connect the normally closed wires from the receiver and the motion sensors. Now you should have the common from the motion sensor free. You may now connect the cable harness to the motion sensor. On the keypad, you will now identify one, the positive or the red wire, the negative, which is your black wire, the common, which is the purple wire, and the normally closed, which is your orange wire. Connect the normally closed from the keypad to the common of the motion sensor. Connect the positive from the keypad to the positive from the transformer. Connect the negative from the keypad to the negative from the transformer. You should now have the common or purple wire free. On the push button, you need to identify the normally closed connection and the common connection. Now connect the common from the keypad to the normally closed connector on the push button.
Connect the extra piece of wire to the common connector on the push button. On your mag lock, identify your positive, which is terminal one, your negative, which is terminal two, the normally open, which is terminal three, normally closed, which is terminal four, and the common, which is terminal five. Bring the wire from the common on the push button to the negative on the magnetic lock, which is terminal two. Connect the wire from the positive on the magnetic lock, which is terminal one, to the positive from the transformer. And this time you should have a fully operational circuit. Connect the power supply and test all the components. Thank you for watching this training video and we'll see you next time.